from my translation library, I wanted mm -hmm. to dump all the translation keys uh, into some JSON file. And therefore, I have to use json.stringify. But I also wanted to have them indented, like uh, you discovered, Andy. So I mm -hmm. discovered that this week, too. And uh, on the other side, I wanted the keys to be um, in ordered so that they don't mess around uh, and, and change the, the, the order. And for that, you can use the second parameter. The replacer, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. that can be a function which um, where you can add some logic uh, to actually I replace property names and, and, yeah. and a lot of things. And mm -hmm. um, I use that to get the right order of the keys. So the JSON will never change. Uh, or, or it's just changing on that line when I added a new key. So I have a, a, a clean diff and just one added line and not some lines jumping around. Yeah, a simple thing like JSON stringify has so many secrets in 